today I am just going to tell you about how to measure the central venous pressure. So basically what is CVP? Central venous pressure is mainly measured via the central venous catheter which is inserted into the superior vena cover near the right atrium. Okay. So what are the indication of that measuring CVP pressure? Is to check that the patient is overhydrated because we are giving extra uh, IV fluid therapy to the patient. So for that purpose we are going to check that central venous pressure. Secondly, uh, we are going to identify that the patient is under that uh, dehydration for that purpose also we are using uh, used to measure that central venous pressure so basically first i'm just going to give a flat position to the patient make sure that the central venous manometer and the patient uh, uh, is in a flat position Attach the IBC to that central venous line. Care pass. Refill the Okay, uh, could you please tell me what is the normal range uh, of uh, CVP monitoring? Okay, so the normal range for the CVP measuring is 8 to 12 mm of HG. Okay, and uh, what are the rationales that we have to follow while we are doing this? Make sure that there will be, uh, uh, that the patient should be in a uh, flat position so that that uh, chest level and the CVP pressure will be accurate. It gives an accurate reading. For that purpose, we are going to make sure that. What happens if we do not give the same, uh, the right position that is the flat position to the patient? Okay, there may be chances of giving inaccurate readings. Okay.